Hello, I'm Matt Robinson with your SCV News Break for Wednesday, April 6th. The victim killed in a fatal collision on Bouquet Canyon Road has been identified as 22-year-old Newberry Park resident Tyler Hartman. Hartman was the passenger in a vehicle that was reportedly going at a high rate of speed when it collided with several trees and a traffic signal pole, according to the L.A. County Coroner's Office. The driver of the vehicle, Justin Rongstad, sustained serious injuries and was transported to Henry Mayo Newhall Hospital. He remains there in critical condition. A vigil to honor both the victims will take place tonight at 8 p.m. at Saugus High School. Well, a Whittier man suspected of causing the fiery multi-vehicle crash in commerce that killed three people pleaded not guilty on Wednesday. 35-year-old Delio Lockhart is charged with three counts of second-degree murder and four counts of reckless driving on a highway causing a specified injury. He is, a su- he is suspected of racing with another driver shortly after midnight on the night of the crash. One of the vehicles lost control, causing a UPS truck to go airborne and land over the center median. The crash killed 52-year-old Scott Treadway, a UPS driver, as well as 18-year-old Santa Clarita resident Brian Lewandowski and 19-year-old Michelle Littlefield, who was also from Santa Clarita. Lockhart is due back in court on May 18th. If convicted, he faces up to life in state prison. Well, we're going to head to a quick break, but when we come back, if you're driving along Golden Valley Road, watch out for a new traffic pattern there. Plus, get ready to dance the night away in Old Town Newhall. Stay tuned. So, same time next week? Well, of course. Put away a few bucks, feel like a million bucks. For free tips to help you save, go to Feed the Pig. Hey, George, there's breaking news. AM 1220 KHTS. I'm George Cummings with breaking news here in the Santa Clarita Valley. It turns out we have an emergency situation Let's going go. on. Ready in five, four, Breaking news from the Santa Clarita Valley. There's an emergency situation happening in Saugus right now, and our news crew is on the scene with more information. Welcome back to SCV News Break. Well, traffic along Golden Valley Road Bridge near State Route 14 shifted Thursday from the south side of the bridge to the north side of the newly constructed part of the bridge. A through lane and a left-hand turn lane remain open in each direction. The changes will allow the city and contractors to begin a new phase in the project to widen the bridge itself. Drivers in this part of town are asked to stay alert about the changes and to expect traffic delays. Well, Thursdays at Newhall is bringing Celtic dance to Old Town this week. Learn traditional Irish dances from professional dance groups and stick around to hear the musical stylings of Patty's Pig. This is a free event and all ages and skill levels are welcome. Well, now turning to weather, high winds, heat and sun lasted through Wednesday, but temperatures are headed for a cool down tonight with a low of 56 degrees. Thursday brings patchy fog and a chance of rain at 40% during the day, bumping up to 50% overnight. Expect rain and chilly weather throughout the weekend as showers are likely to last until Sunday night. Well, that's all for your SCV News Break. For more local news, you can log on to hometownstation.com or scvnews.com. I'm Matt Robinson. Thanks for watching.